Shepard, want a drink? I'm toasting Miranda, I think. How are you getting drunk? Very carefully. Torian brandy, triple filtered, then introduced into the suit through an emergency induction port. That's a straw, Tally. Emergency induction port. It's actually getting a little harder to get it into the slot. I think that means it's working. She was so rude. What did Jack call her? Cerberus cheerleader? With her perfect genes and that attitude and I wish she was here. I didn't realize this would be so hard on you. I didn't like her. Kila, she was such a bitch. But I respected her. Sometimes that's better than liking. She did whatever it took to stop her father. She never gave in to him, never changed herself to please him. Ah. Uh. Don't ah me. You sound like a vorcha. Seeing a bit of yourself in Miranda fighting your father? I spent my life trying to live up to him. Then making up for his mistakes, doing what he'd have wanted. It's never that easy. When do we get to stop reacting to our parents and start living for ourselves? The answer to that one's at the bottom of that glass. I might need help with the induction straw. Port. You know. Here's to Miranda. Rest easy, you genetically perfect Cerberus cheerleader bushnet. Kill us alive. What sort of party are you hoping to have tonight, Commander? I could set things up for quiet conversation, or would you prefer a more energetic evening? Let's keep things relaxed. Certainly, Commander. I'll ensure music remains at an appropriate volume and arrange for some refreshments. I will also modify my appearance to be more festive. Hey, come on in. Thanks for coming. Thanks for the invite. Make yourselves at home. Thank you. Count on it. get over the size of this apartment. The electric bill alone could have paid for my college tuition. Or funded the war. Or made a nice down payment on one of those Atlas mechs. Always one. Check it out. So, Shepard, keeping the hard liquor under lock and key? Otherwise, I'd have to drive you all home. Are we sure the Normandy is still there? Has anyone else tried to steal it? Do you still have your toothbrush? We can always get another Normandy. Call up Cerberus and ask them to please build us the SR-3. But wouldn't that require you to change your name? Tali Zora von Normandy SR-3. It's Voss Normandy. Even I get confused by Quarian names sometimes. We've seen a lot of good times on the old girl. That we have. Indeed. Hear, hear. Some of you more than others. I'm just honored to have squeaked in. To the Normandy. Hi. I'm trying to socialize. I'm not particularly good at it. Not much for big parties? Well, if I know people, sure. But some of your friends are legends. 
I can't just ask if they've tried the hummus. This is nice. I don't spend much time with everyone like this. As friends, I'm glad we could do this. Nice ink. But you got a long way to go to catch up. Nah, I just got this when I lost my squad a few years ago. Hey, what's the story behind that? And... Hey, Shepard. You gonna have a drink? Sure. How's everyone doing? Great so far. This is really nice. It's great. Quiet. After the excitement of the mission, it's a good quiet, right? Seriously? We could ramp it up a little, Shepard. Relax. The night is young. I like it like this. You got it, boss. I'm just happy to be kicking back. Hey, James. Having fun? I'm relaxed. But fun? I think my kindergarten graduation was more fun than this. Very funny. Don't worry. I'll see what I can do. You know if that waterfall is warm water or cold? You know why Cerberus is gonna lose? Demographics. You recruit a guy who's 20 and got no life, he'll work in. Isn't this place marvelous? You know, I miss the days when Cerberus was just hilariously incompetent. You know, when Jacob was in charge. Excuse me? What specific time period are you referring to, Jeff? Hey, Commander, this is Cerberus. We were studying some Rachni, and they got loose and killed all our guys. Can you take care of that? They did rack up quite a body count. At least back then, it was usually their own bodies. We knew some cells were bad, but the Alliance and the Council weren't doing anything. And we were doing good work. True. However, Cerberus did successfully revive Shepard from a near-death state. And after taking down the Collectors, I cut ties with Cerberus, got loose, and started killing all their guys. For which we thank you. Jeff, do you remember that I am also a Cerberus project? Oh, crap. You people watching tonight, Edie? Participant observation. That sounds less friendly. It's actually quite the opposite. Hey, Commander. Weird to see everybody here together. You think? Well, weird, but good. Nice to know it's not always arm wrestling Reapers with us. Anyway, thanks for putting it together. I'll try not to be too embarrassing. Thanks for inviting me, Shepard. It's nice to see you like this. How do you like the new crew? You always attract the best. Have fun. You bet I will. Protein gatherings were nothing like this. We considered the future and respected the dead. Sounds boring. There's usually more yelling and cursing at any gatherings I go to. Yeah. Get a bunch of Krogan together and things always get fun. And probably broken. That sounds more like it. You're right. These things are better when you have redundant systems and natural plate armor. You can't argue with that. So who is strongest, you or the tank braid? Yeah, I'm plenty curious myself. What'd I miss? The Prothean here wants to know who would win in a fight between me and Rex. You gotta admit, Shepard, it's a good question. It is a good question. No, it isn't. Baby Pajak here wouldn't stand a chance. Don't listen to this fossil. The only thing he could defeat is a glass of warm milk. Ha! I got head lice bigger than you, Junior. Huh, we should leave these two lovebirds alone. Let's not. I'd rather not buy new furniture. Reminds me of Cora's den. Haven't been back there in a while. I wonder if there's anything stronger behind the bar. 
Too many things to break in here. Could be a fun party. What kind of music is this? That's uh, not that club crap, is it? In my cycle, too many people in one room risk a high casualty rate if attacked. We should all be careful. 50,000 years from now, no one will remember this party. What is the point? Your guests appear to be enjoying this relaxed atmosphere. Would you like me to keep everything at its current intensity? I think it's time to turn things up a bit. I will arrange for up-tempo music and additional cocktails right away, Commander. see that. Anyone interesting trying to get in? Not really. No. Get lost. <laughs> no. You should maybe let me decide that. Huh? Okay, but I'm telling you it's ugly out there. It can't be that bad. Hello? Grunt, keep up the good work. Will do. I told you already. No! Yes, I like pie. And no, you can't. Hey, Shepard, thanks for the invite. Never been to a human party before. I've had lots to drink. And look at me. Still standing. <laughs> Ever seen a Krogan drink so much they get sick on your floor? I'm here to make sure that dream comes true. I can stop bullets with my mind! You guys, I love you guys. No, no, listen, okay? No, no really. Okay? Shepard. Zaid was just keeping me company. Hello there. You're admiring the art? Beauty, as they say, is in the eye of the beholder. Hey, Shepard. Hey, beautiful. What do you think, Samara? Hang on, hang on. Don't get all snooty on me. I didn't say I didn't like it. I do like it, actually. If I'm completely honest, I'm not sure what it is. I like the way the colors blend and the depth of the... Actually, I have no idea what I'm saying. It makes me feel uneasy. Like when you're alone in the dark, lying in wait, and the cold wind brushes across your face like the kiss of death. Huh. You are a complicated individual, Aid Masani. You bet your sweet Asari ass.
worst planet to get shot down over? We're talking pre-war? Pre-war, life-bearing worlds only. I'm going with Tarif. Garden world, yes, but it's got those chlorine swamps. I will see your Tarif and raise you Azoria, home of toxic spores and athletes. Hey guys, Dr. Chop. No worries, this is fun for us. So, you don't have a sidearm under your pilot's chair? The weapons locker is on the bridge, practically right there. A weapon you can't get to is no weapon at all. When's the last time you trained with a handgun? <laughs> Sometime before I got the ass-kicking robot as my co-pilot. That's no good. What if you have to save Edie someday? Unacceptable. You should always train. Pilots are warriors, too. You know what this is? It's a man emergency. Take this kid out back and make him do target practice. Exactly. Some range time will fix you up. Right, Commander? You are not taking me shooting. My testosterone levels are plenty high. I fly a deadly war machine, remember? Joker, I'm surprised at you. What about the collector attack? The bridge can get dangerous. Hey, they totally proved my point. If I'd fired off a shot then, I would have been mobbed. The real weapon is your brain. Take that away, you got nothing. Still would have been nice to have a little backup at the sushi bar. You know, there's a combat simulator on the Citadel. Hell no. Maybe a shooting range if we're not letting this go. Maybe. But not while I'm wasted. Or hungover. Hungover is the perfect time to train. Makes you angry at every loud noise. Cortez, you're on. If you're in condition to take me there, you can. But tonight, you gotta match me, shot for shot. Great party. I'd better see you out on the dance floor later. We'll see. Absolutely. Biotics are impressive. I'm not saying they aren't. You're just saying that they're not that impressive. I'm not saying anything. I'm just saying. Oh, shit. No, it's fine. I'm sure no one here is insulted. Not yet. Maybe. I'm just saying. <sighs> what I'm trying to say is... I mean, check out these guns. Biotics can't give you this kind of fine instrument. The peak physical form that you see before you. Okay, you work for it. I get that. I mean it. Check me out. Is there more to your argument? Come on in closer. Don't be shy. <laughs> yeah, don't be shy. Hey, what's going on here? Everyone playing nice? Of course, Shepard. James was just explaining how physical conditioning trumps biotics. Really? You go in there, James? Come in. Just listen. Biotics are strong, but unpredictable. All that cooling down. Shepard, where did you find this guy? I don't cool down, big guy. A person can improve their physique, but biotics, they are what they are. He's joking. Right, James? I mean, what's your point exactly? Okay, okay, maybe it's not conditioning exactly. Maybe it's just the condition of one James Vega. Hey, Liara, check it out. This guy here never has to cool down. In fact, the hotter, the better. Hilarious. I'm gonna have to go with James on this one. Oh, thanks, Shepard. Biotics are a little intangible when there's an example of physical excellence standing in front of you. Nice. Great. Now we'll never hear the end of it. First questionable decision I've seen you make. Ever. Check it out. I can also roll my tongue. Oh, my. That's... Shepard, if that's your decision, I support you. Always. James, please stop doing that.
specialist trainer. May I ask you a question? You could ask me anything, Edie. When you believed me to be a simple VI, you made comments about my voice. Oh no. Should I find somewhere else to be? No! No, no, I wanted to ask you about... Uh, weren't you saying something about the Normandy's drive corp? Uh, no. Could you? I wish to understand why you find my voice sexually attractive. Oh, that was a while ago. I can't even remember what I said exactly. She does. Would you like me to play back my recordings of your statements? Told you. Tolly, please stop helping. What's wrong, you two? I am asking Specialist Trainer about why she found my voice sexually attractive. This is a really good cheese, Shepard. I put some in through the filters. Is it organic? On one occasion, you said that you wanted to, quote, pin my voice against the wall and run your tongue along its collarbone. Well, uh, there's a context there that... Uh, you were talking about quantum entanglement and uh, I didn't know you were an AI. <laughs> There's some kind of herb in the cheese that I can't quite place. Is it sage or basil? Anyway, I was just joking. You know, stress of the retrofits and... Really? My diagnostic suggested that you were genuinely aroused. It's really rare to get herbed dextro cheeses. The Turians almost never bother. You have diagnostics. Cerberus programmed you to check body language. I get more reliable results measuring pupil dilation and thermal readings of erogenous zones. Oh, good lord. Wait, this is dextro cheese, right? Kila, did I forget to scan the cheese? This is why I don't drink. Fair is fair, trainer. Edie has a right to ask about what you said. I was very interested in trainer's ability to develop sexual feelings for what was at the time, a bodiless voice. You are all terrible. Edie, I apologize for saying that I wanted to roll naked with your voice in certain sheets. Oh, I was not offended. In fact, it was flattering. Even the part where I wanted to grab your voice by the hair and nibble my way down its back. I do not, in fact, remember you saying that, Samantha. Oh! That wasn't out loud. Never mind. Don't mind me. I'm just going to run a toxin treatment program. So I don't die. I'm just going to sit here quietly and hope someone changes the subject. Awkward? Awkward. Your guests appear to be enjoying themselves, Commander. What shall I do now? Let's turn up the music and get some people dancing. Very good, Commander. I have had little opportunity to use my bounce and spin functionality. bring out those moves more often, trainer. You and I dancing at the same time. Too dangerous. We'd light the room on fire. This is unexpected and fun. I'm always amazed humans can dance with the way your legs bend. The way our legs bend. Yes, you and the Asari. I'm surprised you don't tip over. I don't tip over until I've found company, dog legs. Till then, Watch and learn. Hell yeah! <laughs> Go for it! <laughs> <laughs> Captain on deck! Has he always been like this? Shepard is saving the galaxy. You have to forgive a few eccentricities. It's very enthusiastic. It is impressive. 
We should record this and broadcast it for the Reapers. They'll either run away, melt down, or fall in love. Don't tire yourself out flailing like that, Shepard. We're doing it on the table later. Hey, some of us eat at that table. <laughs> Buddy, you got that right. Dancing during wartime wastes precious energy. Can't dance myself. I move like a greased one-legged varin. <laughs> Not a pretty picture. What's going on over here? Shepard! Found something to shoot. Yeah, I can see that. It's okay, we're all professionals here. Some of us with no depth perception, but it's fine. Don't worry. This happens at Krogan parties all the time. And yet I'm still not comfortable. Probably best I walk away now. As you wish. events like this. It is customary to dance with friends or loved ones. Would you dance with me? It's gonna take a lot more than a polite request to make that happen, Edie. I have recordings of you talking in your sleep that would make for a highly amusing extranet video. Okay, that's cheating. So we won't dance with you, huh? Hello, Shepard. You will not. Well, I will. Should dance with her. Other people are dancing, Jeff. Yes, they are. And I am sitting here enjoying my drink. Joker. No. Come on. No. Seriously? Ugh, fine. physical supremacy. But can you do that with a drink and a snack at each hand? Sure. Ugh. Wow. Okay, now. Let's find a more fun way to get sweaty. Come on. Let's dance. Get a photo to remember this. Arrange yourselves on the sofa. An excellent suggestion, Shepard. Great idea. I want a copy. Make way. Make way. Thanks for coming, everyone. Here's to us. Ready, Glyph? Of course. 
If you could all please direct your attention this way. Okay. Everyone say Normandy. Normandy! here <sighs> that was nice it's good to just relax every once in a while relax are you even hung over nope you want me to find some vodka and we can go again let's see if anyone else is up Was someone making tea? I could use some tea. The apartment seems so quiet now. The apartment seems so quiet now. Did we, uh, break anything last night? I don't suppose you need anything around here. Calibrated. <laughs> yeah, okay, maybe I should just stop saying that word, but only if Liara stops saying, By the goddess. Good thing this place has extra bathrooms. Liara takes forever to do her, uh, hair, or whatever she calls it. Shepard, good morning. I want to thank you for inviting me here. It was good to see everyone again. I hope you enjoyed your evening as well. I am going to die. I didn't know you could go through that many toxin filters in one night. Do I have a tattoo? I remember something about a tattoo. Don't get me wrong. Great party, but... Ugh, yeah. I'll just be here. Right here. Forever. Ugh. Shepard, I was just going to lift some weights. Want to join? I feel fantastic. How about everyone else? 1085, 1086, 1087. Shepard? Hey, you look like shit. You know the best part of an overcharged biotic amp? No hangovers. Even normal biotics get hangovers, but I can drink until I puke and still wake up just peachy. That was fun. You guys even kept up with me there for a while. I think I broke my head on something last night. Bathroom is all cleaned up, Shepard. Good as new. Shepard. Okay, who wants eggs? Liara, eggs? Trainer. Esteban, eggs? Joker, where is that guy? Rex, buddy, eggs? Tally? 
Nah, she'll definitely want eggs. Javik, man, you gotta try my eggs. Anyone else? Garrus, you know my eggs. Shepard, eggs? Shepard. Mm, morning, Shepard. Hope you slept well. Oh, I would have thought all those tequila shots with James would have prepared me for last night. What a night. Wish it never ended. Thanks, Shepard. Thanks, Shepard. Shepard, good to see you up. Hope I didn't wake anyone up with my snoring. I go like a buzzsaw since I got my nose broke. By the way, you're almost out of bacon. Our bacon, anyway. There's still some of that dextro shit in the freezer. I saved you three strips. Figured it was fair payback for all the times you saved mine, right? Shepard? Some neighbors came by last night to complain about the noise. I put their bodies in the building incinerator. That was a joke. I have nothing else to report. I recommend breakfast. Been a while since I hit the hard stuff. About time. You live past 700. You start paying for a night like that the next morning. Huh? Hey, Commander. Hell of a night. So I've managed not to throw up. Feeling pretty good about that. Oh, if everyone could just not talk so loudly, that would be great. Or close the cupboards too loud. Or walk too loud. You know, just, just think quiet thoughts. Ugh. Still fun, though. 